Hi everyone, I'm Frank Jimenez with the BuildRaw team. In this video, I will show you how to add and configure the timer element inside Cheetah. So whether you're launching a new product, celebrating a business anniversary, or doing a complete website makeover, a great way to create some excitement around these types of events is to use the timer element inside Cheetah. Now here we are inside the personal trainer site. Now let's go down to a promotion. Now here's an elite package that is valued at $190. Now, when the timer expires, what's going to happen is we are going to be able to access that new page, at least my customers are, right, to be able to get the $190 value elite package for $69.90. Let's go in and set this up. So all we need here is a timer. To add a timer, just go to the very top, select elements, and let's go down to timers. Now, all you have to do is select one. So let's go ahead and pick this one here. And drag it okay now just um, let's go ahead and center this element now since this is already selected right all of the properties pertaining to your timer shows up right here let's click on general settings now right now the theme is set to simple let's take a look at other themes All right, so for this example, let's keep it at uh, simple. And then your type is currently set to countdown. You can also change it to specific date time, evergreen, or refresh timer. Now for this example, we're going to go ahead and select specific date time. Let's go in and adjust the date. Now when configuring the hours or the time, think military time. So right now, the current time is 8.01 p.m. So that would be 20. And let's go up to the top here. And let's do 8.03 is when we're going to release the new page to customers. We're down to 51 seconds. So let's give ourselves a little bit more time. There you go. Maybe one more minute, right? And just as I mentioned, you can continue going through all of the different properties here and adjusting your timer to your liking and once you're all set the last thing you need to do is go over here to the timer right click it again select link and then attach the page that you want to attach so for here we want to attach page name project transformation and then go to select all that is left is for you to go up to the top and select save okay so here we are now let's scroll down to the timer and we are just 10 seconds away so if this is set up properly what's going to happen is that at the end of the timer we are we will be redirected to a new page and there you are and that is how you configure the timer element inside cheetah I hope you found the information in this video helpful. I'm Frankie Menes with the Build Raw team. 